Throughout history, African presidents have faced unique security challenges, including political instability, terrorism threats, and potential risks to their personal safety. As we embark on this journey, we will examine the reasons behind the heightened security measures, the strategies employed to mitigate risks, and the impact of these measures on the presidency and the nation as a whole. Join us as we uncover the untold stories of the most protected African presidents and gain a deeper understanding of the complex interplay between power, security, and leadership on the African continent. If you enjoy our content leave a like and a sub so more people can see this. Ten, Mamadou Dambuya. Mamadou Dambuya, a former member of the Guinean Special Forces Group and a former French legionnaire, rose to prominence as the leader of a coup d'état on September 5, 2021, which toppled the previous president, Alpha Conde. Following the coup, Dambuya assumed control and dissolved the government and constitution, declaring himself the interim president. With his background in the military, Dambuya prioritizes security. When traveling, he opts for practicality over luxury, choosing to move in armored vehicles such as Humvees on land and relying on helicopters for air transportation. Surrounding himself with numerous bodyguards, his security entourage may not exude opulence, but they are always prepared for potential threats, maintaining a high level of alertness and combat readiness. 9. William Ruto William Ruto is a Kenyan politician who assumed the presidency on September 13, 2022, becoming the fifth president of Kenya. Before his presidency, Ruto served as the elected deputy president of Kenya from 2013 to 2022. Ruto rides in an armored land cruiser, 10 high-speed motorcycles, 7 high-speed Toyota SUVs, a Mercedes-Benz X-Class, and a Range Rovers. His entourage of bodyguards consists of more than 10 heavy personnel. 8. Paul Biya Paul Biya has been the elected president of Cameroon since November 6, 1982, making him the second longest-serving president in Africa and the world's longest-serving non-royal leader. He has consistently won re-election with significant margins, despite allegations of voting irregularities and fraud by opposition politicians and Western governments during the contentious 1992 presidential election. Throughout his 40-year rule, Bia has demonstrated a preference for luxury and security. He travels in armored vehicles such as the Range Rover Sentinels and on special occasions, he is chauffeured in an armored limousine. Bia's motorcade is known for its high-speed land cruisers and Mercedes-Benz vehicles, accompanied by a sizable company of special bodyguards, highlighting the level of protection surrounding him. 7. Paul Kagame Paul Kagame, a former military officer, is a Rwandan politician who has been serving as the fourth and current president of Rwanda since 2000. Prior to his presidency, Kagome commanded the Rwandan Patriotic Front, a rebel force that invaded Rwanda in 1990 and played a significant role in ending the Rwandan genocide and the Rwandan civil war. Despite his long tenure of over 22 years, Kagome is widely respected by his countrymen as a leader. He prioritizes security and travels in armored vehicles such as the Range Rover Sentinels, which provide advanced protection against direct hits. Kagame's motorcade includes security motorcycles, high-speed Mercedes-Benz cars, land cruisers, and a contingent of bodyguards to ensure his safety. 6. Abdel Fattah El-Sisi Abdel Fattah El-Sisi, a retired military officer and politician, has been serving as the sixth and current president of Egypt since 2014. Prior to his presidency, he held various high-ranking positions in the Egyptian government, including Deputy Prime Minister, Defense Minister, and Director of Military Intelligence. Sisi's extensive military background has shaped his leadership style and approach to governance. As the President of Egypt, Sisi is among the most heavily protected African presidents. His security is of utmost importance, and he is known for ruling with a firm hand. 
His presidential vehicle, a Mercedes S-Class, is equipped with special features and bears a distinctive black number plate. Egypt's strong armed forces further ensure his safety and security. 5. Cyril Ramaphosa Cyril Ramaphosa has a distinguished political career, having served as the Secretary General to Nelson Mandela, the President of the African National Congress. He later became the Deputy President to Jacob Zuma and chaired the National Planning Commission. As one of the most protected African presidents, Ramaphosa's security measures are notable. In contrast to other presidents, Ramaphosa opts for crossovers instead of sedans or SUVs for his transportation. Emerson Mnangagwa, a Zimbabwean revolutionary and politician, assumed the presidency on November 24, 2017, following a tumultuous period of political transition. As a longtime ally of former President Robert Mugabe, Mnangagwa held various cabinet positions and served as Mugabe's vice president until he was dismissed in November 2017, ultimately taking power through a coup. In the controversial 2018 general election, he secured his first full term as president. Given the political unrest in Zimbabwe, ensuring the safety and security of the president becomes a paramount concern. Unengagwa is surrounded by a heavy security presence, particularly during official engagements both domestically and internationally. His security detail includes high-speed motorcycles, armored Mercedes-Benz vehicles, land cruisers, and a significant number of well-trained special forces personnel. 3. Alassane Ouattara Since 2010, he has served as president of the Ivory Coast. He currently ranks as one of the most protected African president. Ouattara is always accompanied by heavy security guards whenever he goes in or out of the country. Ouattara's car is heavily supported by heavily armored personnel and presidential guards who follow his vehicle on foot until he gets out of reach of the public. 2. Mohammed V of Morocco Mohammed, the King of Morocco, is a member of the Alawi dynasty and assumed the throne on July 23, 1999, succeeding his father, King Hassan II. He possesses significant business interests in various sectors of the Moroccan economy. According to Forbes, his net worth has been estimated to range from $2.1 billion to over $8.2 billion, making him the richest king in Africa and the fifth wealthiest monarch globally. When it comes to his presidential vehicles, Mohammed travels in an armored Mercedes-Benz and multiple Range Rovers. Additionally, he utilizes armored BMWs and communication-equipped Humvees for off-road travels. 1. Bola Ahmed Tinubu President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, also known as Jagaban, is a Nigerian politician who has been a major force in Nigerian politics for over two decades. He is the current president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and a former governor of Lagos State from 1999 to 2007. Bola Ahmed Tinubu is the president of the most populous African nation, his safety is the country's topmost priority. His convoy consists of many motorcades which is the largest and most impressive in the continent. President Buhari's is almost impossible to penetrate. The security comprises of high-speed security motorcade and special security guard. In summary, our investigation into the security arrangements of African presidents sheds light on the intricate dynamics of political power and protection in the region. The heightened security measures implemented for these leaders underscore the inherent dangers and complexities they encounter while fulfilling their roles. The extensive security apparatus surrounding these presidents serves as a response to the constant threats they face and the imperative to maintain stability and uninterrupted governance in their nations. Through fortified motorcades, armored vehicles, and dedicated security personnel, these measures play a vital role in safeguarding the well-being and safety of these leaders in an ever-changing and uncertain global landscape. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and a sub and we'll catch you guys in the next one.